Well, welcome everybody. My name is Danielle Matthews and I'm here today with Dr. David Silverman. He is on the medical board of the company and he and I both actually have been part of ASEA for over a decade uh, using the technology ourselves, sharing with others. And uh, we have fielded a lot of questions over the years. And so we thought it would be great to just kind of take the common questions we've gotten and answer them here for you, because very likely you've had an experience with the Renew 28, you've used this gel and you're going, how did it just do that? Why is this working? <laughs> and and uh, you're likely going to want to learn more about this because this is a CS flagship technology. So uh, without getting into everything, I want to introduce to you Dr. David Silverman. Uh, he, in his previous life, owned a surgery center. Uh, he was a foot surgeon. He owned his own practice and surgery center, but he sold that. And his mind was kind of expanded to ways to support people outside of pills and surgery. And uh, <laughs> through just the way that the universe works, uh, he found his way to ASEA, and he'll share that story. But he has now been on ASEA's medical board for 12 years, and he has helped tens of thousands of people around the world learn about this technology and uh, integrate it into their lives and help their families. So he's a wealth of knowledge, and um, I have gotten him today so that we can answer most of the questions that you might be having and uh, get it straight from the source. So David, I'm going to hand things over to you if you can kind of kick things off with a, a little introduction. Yeah, absolutely. Thanks. And I'm so glad to, to be here with you, Danielle. And if you are um, watching this, most likely, as Danielle said, you've already had an experience with the gel version of the drink, Renew 28. And it probably shocked you. If you had something that was hurting you, your neck, your back, your knee, and your friend had had you apply it three times in the first five minutes, and then instead of looked at their watch at 10 minutes and said, how do you feel? There's a very, very, very high chance that you were kind of shocked. And if you didn't see, if you didn't have anything hurting you, or you do, didn't admit you had anything hurting you and didn't do that, if they did a strength and balance test on you, you felt your strength increase and you felt your balance better. And you can see that your body has a lot more potential than, than maybe you thought. And the body has to be given certain things so it can reach its potential, whether it's hurting or balance or strength. And that's the tip of the iceberg. And you probably have questions about this. I'll just tell you that... Um, your friend's sharing a gift with you, inviting you over to their house or their office, and maybe you're just having some coffee or fruit or a cocktail or whatever it is, but not to chit chat about the weather or the sports teams or whatever. It's to talk about something really important that can change your life, can change your life. 13 years ago, this was brought to me by a friend and she didn't know, my friend Debbie didn't know my dad was just told he had something very scary in his body, something no one wants to hear they have anywhere in their body, whether it's their prostate or their lung or their breast or their pancreas or whatever it is. <clears throat> but I listened carefully. I was motivated to listen because my dad was ill. Whatever your motivation is from what you just experienced with the gel, just know that this is, that's the tip of the iceberg. That is, this is a massive breakthrough for humanity. Just comes in a strange package, blue bottle, made from salt and water, literally made from salt and water. I shot a video called, it. it's a video at itwassaltwater.com. You can go there, you can see it, uh, that it's not salt water anymore. This is patented, there's intellectual property on this. The company's 15 years old. They've done 1.3 billion in sales in over 30 countries. This isn't salt water. And you just experienced it. That's the beautiful thing about having people to your home. If you decide to share this, when you see what it really does and you wanna share it, Instead of talking about it, what it does, give them an experience like you just had. So really, really happy to be here. Um, in case you have no context on this at all, you probably had a short video played before they even put the gel on you. But to give you context real quickly, this is very unique. It's called redox signaling molecules. So is this, this is the gel version of the drink. This is cellular health from the inside out, cellular health from the outside in. But what's unique about it is it's in you. Your cells make this. It's called redox signaling molecules. And people say, well, why do I want to drink it if my cells make it? Because you made more when you were younger. And just think about what you what life was like when you were younger. Come home from school, you fall down, you get up the next day, you go to school, you don't feel it. What happens if you're, I'm 63 years old. If I fall down, what happens if you're 63 years old or 40 years old? You don't heal as quickly. Well, what happens is you produce this, but at puberty, you start producing less. So it's produced in your mitochondria, inside your cells. So when I was 10, I made this much. When I was 15, I made this much. 20, 30, 40, 50, I'm 63. My cells make this much. I drink this, I raise my levels up to what they were when I was younger. My cells keep making it, but I'm raised my levels up. It's a biohack. And it doesn't cure me. It 
doesn't heal me. It doesn't cure or heal you. What it does is it amplifies signaling. It makes it so your, your cells can talk to one another. Your, your immune system can hear when you've fallen off your bicycle and broken a bone and you have damaged cells. It can hear when you have cells that, that are mutating. We, we all have cells that are mutating, but we don't all get that horrible disease, but you see more of it as we get older. And why? Because the immune system is not attacking it. Well, why isn't the immune system attacking it? Maybe you have a weak immune system, but maybe it's not getting the signal, the signal that there's a problem. So this doesn't cure or heal you. It's not, we're not in the healing business. This does not cure or heal you. What it does is it, it makes the body aware of problems. We're in the knowing business, not the healing business, okay? And so it's very, very safe. We'll go through that. We're going to go through the most common questions that people ask right now. Yeah. Well, and safety is the number one. So uh, people want to know, you know, can they be allergic to it? Is there any toxicity, contraindications? Athletes have a lot of questions about safety, diet restrictions that some people have, you know, safe for your wallet. What if it doesn't work? Do I get my money back? So if you could kind of hit that um, first and then we'll dive into some deeper things. Yeah. And I, I'll tell you what I love about this conversation, Danielle, is that I know that that everybody watching this is sitting there with their friend and they had an experience with this already. So it's not hearsay. They're like they're, they, they've had their 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 experience and go do that on 10 people and watch what happens to nine of the 10 people. Do exactly what happened to you for whatever was hurting you. Do it on 10 people and watch what happens to average nine out of 10 people and you'll be stunned. But as far as safety goes, and I was concerned about with my dad, let me share my screen. Uh, that is my dad right now. He just just passed several months ago, but that was that that was taken a year and a half ago. But I think I got 13 more years uh, with my dad uh, because of what uh, the fact that my friend brought me this gift, like just like your friends bringing you this gift. So um, it's not a pharmaceutical. It's in, it's native to the body. It's in you. It's made from salt and water. Remember, go to itwassaltwater.com if you want more information on that. But safety versus pharmaceuticals, safety for athletes, they have to worry about banned substances, safety for diet restrictions, and safety for the wallet. So most importantly, most we're, we're kind of brainwashed to take medicines for everything, right? Because I was trained to do that, right? To make a diagnosis and, and, and um, write a prescription or do the proper surgery. Well, there's risks with medicines. What are the risks? You could be allergic to a medicine. A medicine could interact with another medicine right? That you're taking now or that you take in the future. <laughs> a lot of people take medicines in the future because of side effects from the medicines they're taking now. And also medicines are toxic. They're not supposed to be in your body. I repeat that. Medicines are toxic. They're not supposed to be in your body. That's why there are dosages on medicines. You can't just take 20 Advil because you have a bad headache or 20 Tylenol. It'll make you sick or it'll kill you because they're toxic. Use a dosage that you take. So can you be allergic to a SIA? Absolutely not. It's in you. It's in everybody. In fact, it's safer than foods. People say that's not safer than foods. Really? Give a person that has a peanut allergy a peanut and see what happens to them, right? But you can give anybody this because it's in everybody. Everybody's the person that's allergic to peanuts, their cells are making these redox molecules. If you're taking medications, can you take this? Absolutely. It's invisible to medications because it's already in you and there's no toxicity to it. No toxicity to it. Every pharmaceutical, every medicine, whether it's aspirin, acetaminophen, Every prescription medicine, chemotherapy, it has a number. It's called an LD50. And when they test the, the, the medicine on animals before they do it on humans, they have to come up with this number before they give it to the FDA for human trials. And it stands for LD50, lethal dose 50. At what dosage did that medicine kill half the rats? Think about that. At what dosage did it kill half the rats? If there's a dosage that kills half the rats, there's a dosage that'll kill 100% of the rats. The dosage that kills 100% of the rats, there's a dosage that'll kill 100% of humans. Every medicine has one. This is a breakthrough. This is not a medicine. This is a different from, from, a, from a pharmaceutical as the light bulb was to the flame, a candle. There is no, they couldn't find an LD50. They couldn't find one. The more you drink, uh, if you drink more than your body needs, let's say you saturate yourself, your body just turns the excess back into salt and water, which is what it was, saline. Safety for athletes, no banned substances. It's made in an FDA registered production facility. It's NSF certified and important for athletes, NSF sports certified and WADA approved. What's WADA? The World Anti-Doping Agency. We have Olympic gold medalists on this product, safe as water, no banned substances. Diet restrictions. Well, hey, some people are kosher, some people are halal, some people are, are gluten and dairy free. 
it's certified kosher, certified halal, gluten and dairy free, and the amount of sodium in it, someone says, uh, my doctor says, don't take it, it's salt and water. Just have the doctor read the darn label. There's 125 milligrams of sodium in four ounces of this, which is 120 ml of water. Four ounces, there's more sodium in a glass of milk. Look at, look, look at the back of a label of milk. Uh, or more sodium in a piece of bread, more sodium in three big carrots. So there's very low sodium. The, the, the most important molecules that are in here or atoms that are in here are, are uh, hydrogen and oxygen, not the sodium and the chloride, but there needs to be some of it in there to make these molecules identical to what's in you. Safety for the wallet. There's no risk. There's a money back guarantee for 30 days and nice people can get their product for free. Nice people can get their product for free on an ongoing basis. And, and Danielle, you'll cover that later. You're muted. Sorry about that. Uh, the next thing to talk about is proper usage. So how does somebody actually take this? Can you speak to that? And also expectations, kind of the timeline for seeing results, because, you know, we all want instant gratification, but what is what is the real expectation with something that's helping with ourselves? Well, the nice thing for the instant gratification is this. Uh, go put it on 10 people and do what you just did for th something was hurting you, right? We'll talk about that in just a second. But let me talk about the gel, the drink. The drink is very important. Um, you want to give it 90 days, but you want to know where you're starting. So go to myredox.info and you'll see Health Tracker and FAQ is also there. It's a really great site that Danielle put together. Myredox.info. And it says, where are you in all of these areas today before you start taking a SIA? So on day zero, baseline everything in your health and go down the columns and the things that you your problem will jump out at you. Maybe you have ringing in your ear. Maybe that's the worst thing for you, so rate it. Maybe you have low mood, so rate it. Maybe you have blood sugar problem. What's your blood sugar in the morning? We're not claiming this is gonna help anything because we're not allowed to make medical claims, but you can just take it and watch what happens with it with safe as water with a money back guarantee for 30 days. Right. So you baseline not just your major problem, but everything. Look at every because I don't know what's going to change. I'm going to give you expectations. I don't know what's going to change first, but just every single thing baseline it. Right. And then also baseline your athletic performance. You don't have to be an Olympic athlete. Maybe it's how many sets of pickleball you play. Maybe it's how many how many rounds of golf you play, how, how fast you can run a mile. Baseline your your performance and your recovery, how fast you recover blood pressure and pulse. And if you're not an athlete, then ignore that. Just pay attention to your energy level up at the top. It says, what's your energy level? I'm 63, I feel like I'm 30 years old. I'm not an athlete. And at the bottom it says, take pictures, take serial photographs, skin, hair, and nails, wrinkles, problem areas, uh, age spots, sunspots, cellulite, thinning hair, nail issues. You're baselining everything about your health, just like you did with, with the gel for something that was hurting. What did you do? You baselined your hurting level on a scale of one to 10. You applied the gel three times in five minutes and at 10 minutes you reassessed. Well, this you wanna reassess every seven, 30, 90 days. Instructions on using it, stay well hydrated, drink a lot of water. Your body's gonna detox. You wanna urinate those toxins out. As your cells release that garbage, you wanna urinate it out. So stay well hydrated. Don't mix it with anything. It comes with a little two ounce cup or 60 ml cup. You take the liquid, you pour it into the cup. Here, Danielle's holding it up right now, that little cup. Pour it into the cup, put it in your mouth, hold it for 30 seconds. Do not drink out of the bottle. Your saliva will start to de destabilize. It'll just turn back into salt water. Pour it in the cup, cap it, put it in your mouth, hold it for 30 seconds before you swallow it. Why? Because it gets into your bloodstream through absorption, not digestion, but definitely swallow it. It's going to get into your esophagus, your stomach wall. That's what you do. Okay. Now, how much do you take in expectations to see changes? The first week you drink four ounces a day. That's two of the, a cup in the morning, a little, those cups, one in the morning, one at night. That's four ounces a day. It's, that's 120 ml. You went through about a bottle. Now look, the bottle say 32 ounces, it's real, they're really filled to 36. The company gives you enough to do what I'm saying here. They're gonna, they're giving you enough to do what I say here. <clears throat> so at day seven, you went through 28 ounces. If you put it in a little spray bottle and you were spraying it on your thinning hair or spraying it in your eyes, you went through a little more than 28 ounces, but you still didn't go through the bottle. But let's say you went through about a bottle the first week. What are the expectations? What percentage of people say hallelujah? I saw a major change on something on that left column there. Something shifted dramatically. 15% of people, they're called fast responders. They stay at the four ounces a day, the 120 ml a day. 
But the 85% of people that didn't see anything, they double it to the magic eight. They go to eight ounces a day now temporarily, and they stay there until they see their shift. And I'll tell you what to do once you see your shift. But you commit to, to go to eight ounces a day, and you stay there until you see your change. I drink eight ounces a day every day. Most people end up at about six ounces a day or 180 ml. We'll talk about that. But this is the way, the reason, only reason it won't start you with the magic eight is because of detox. More people would have detox symptoms. They'd have a headache and things like that, rash. Minim, minimal amount of people have that if they follow these instructions. It can still happen, but stay well hydrated. If you started at eight ounces a day, if you're inpatient, go ahead and start at eight ounces a day. But you, and understand you're increasing the chance of having detox symptoms. So once you, by day 30, if you follow these instructions, what percentage of people say, wow, they saw a dramatic shift, something, ha something happened on that left column there in their health, about 60, 60%. That still leaves 40% of people that don't see anything. That's why you give it 90 days because 90% of people um, by day, 90% of people by day 90, if they, if they benchmarked very well at the beginning, say, wow, I saw a dramatic shift in something, one or more things there right? Okay. So once you see your shift, what do you do? Decrease it. Stay at the, stay at the magic eight for about uh, um, a week and then decrease to what we call the essential six. The sweet spot is about six ounces a day. And on subscription, when you get on subscription, so you can go through these 90 days on this, um, it, they have this essentials bundle, which gives you exactly enough to do that. Um, you, 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 it's six ounces a day, um, and it gives it gives you six bottles of a sea. It gives you six ounces a day minimally, and you get a free tube of the gel, which you already experienced, and free shipping. It's the best deal the company has, and they do that so that people can get what they need. Some people are okay on four ounces a day, younger, healthier people, but and some people need eight, some people need ten, but the majority of people need the essential six, six ounces a day, and that essentials bundle is the way to do that. Now. Some people say, well, why don't they guarantee it for 90 days if 90% of people are stunned by day 90? Because you already know why. Because you already experienced it. There's no need. Anybody who wants to validate this, for whatever reason they want to validate it for, to know that it's real can do it in 10 minutes with the gel version of the drink. Now, it's marketed for anti-aging. Your friend can show you a lot more pictures of before and after what it does for wrinkles and cellulite and all of that. But the magic of it is what it does when someone's hurting. Not only what it does for the hurting, but what it does to open a person's mind. A lot of people investigate this on Google. And Google's great, but Google's a search engine. It's not a research engine. And people saying, oh, it's just salt water. It's a scam. You know, when you have an experience with it, doesn't matter what anybody says. It doesn't matter what anybody says. If you never had lobster and everybody in your family says, oh, don't eat it. It tastes like scorpion. It looks like a spider. Don't eat lobster. And you taste it. You're like, wow, mom and dad were wrong. This is really good doesn't matter what anybody says, right? It, because you experienced it. You know that it's real, okay? So experience it on things that hurt. You probably did this in your friend's house where you are right now. And this is what you do. You find 10 people who are hurting. And you do this simple 10-minute test. The whole thing takes 10 minutes. 10 people for 10 minutes. They assess their level of hurting on a scale of 1 to 10. They apply the gel three times in five minutes. And at 10 minutes, you ask them how they feel. That's what you do, right? You sh they shake up the gel, which is clear. There's no smell. There's no greasiness. I'm putting it on my face. It's marketed for anti-aging. Find 10 people who are hurting. They rate their hurting level on a scale of 1 to 10. They apply the gel once it dries, twice it dries, three times it dries, three times in five minutes. And at 10 minutes, ask them how they feel. And watch what nine out of 10 people tell you. And if the 10th one says, well, I'm not really seeing anything, have them repeat the process and put it on the vagus nerve right here as well. You can do that the first time around because it kind of augments everything. And you'll know three things. It's real. It's not salt water. Two, it's easy to prove it's real. And, and you realize you know about something before everybody else in the whole world. That's the best way to take the product, Danielle. Wonderful. Well, that was a comprehensive answer. So thank you. And, you know, one of the most common things that I hear is, you know, people want to know, well, what about their issue, right? So someone maybe has Parkinson's or COPD or their kid is on the spectrum or, you know, their parent is having memory loss issues. What can you talk about with specific health issues and how ASEA can support that? 
Well, the word support is is right because it doesn't heal anything. I, someone says, well, it help MS or Parkinson's. I'll say it doesn't help you. Your body has potential. If if the body is aware of a problem, potentially your body could help it, right? So I put a site together that answers a lot of these common questions. It's called gettingyoungerclub.com. So when you go to gettingyoungerclub.com, uh, you'll see a lot of interest-specific um answers to questions basically right so what are redox molecules number three uh what do they do in the body how do they work i want to, i want to see the research right so if let's say you're a research person click that you, you you'll have it right not everybody cares about the research but you do go there why is it made from salt and water how is it made there's a, a tour through the production facility uh the fda registered production facility um, how do you know it's real? Well, that's what I just talked about the three times in five minutes. That's a 10 minute test. What about my issue? That's what we're going to come to in just a second. But if you want, let's say you just want to look younger. A lot of people say, I don't believe any of this stuff, but you know what? I always say, if someone's cynical about this, I'll, I'll say, would you, do you want to look, do you want to look, raise your hand if you want to look older next year than you do now, or you want to look older five years from now, everybody laughs, nobody raises their hand company has a whole line of skin cell products that make you look younger. And when there's a money back guarantee for 30 days, if you don't believe anything about the redox, you just want to look younger, say, I'll give it 30 days, do it all, take pictures. You won't even have to look at the pictures at the end of the month because people are going to say, God, you look younger. What are you doing? Honest to God. I mean, it's just, it just, the stuff is amazing, right? Um, if you're interested in athletic performance, then you're going to want to come to that link right? You want to look at the other products the company has. They have a whole line of products that are focused on the human cell and reaching your potential. There's information on all of it. Here, here's why it's marketed through word of mouth marketing, how the company started. Everybody should watch this. You got to see how this company started and how they refused to sell out to a pharmaceutical company. And you want to get your product for free? Just, just pay it forward. This is, this is the company pays you on a residual basis. So when people say, what about my issue? I bring them to number nine. I say, go to number nine, put in the password redox, R-E-D-O-X, but lowercase letters. These are all people sharing what happened with them. All people that, which all different kinds of problems, right? So there's Danielle's story. You'll hear in a few minutes, she was hit by a drunk driver, right? Sure, she had a brain injury. Maybe you want to hear her story. Maybe you know somebody that their body hurts, right? Because their joints hurt. Well, here's a two-time Super Bowl champion. You think you think he was hurting? Um, he's sharing what happened with him. Maybe you know somebody who's got an, an immune system problem, or maybe you got somebody who's got a breathing problem or a sleeping problem. And you don't have to go scrolling through all these. What you do is you come here and you watch this video first. It's an overview. It's less than 10 minutes. Very important. Translates into 28 languages. And then this is what everybody wants. Because nobody cares about blood pressure unless they have a or they have a blood pressure problem or they love somebody who does. Nobody cares about allergies unless they have an allergy problem. Nobody really cares about about memory unless they have a memory problem. But if you have a memory problem, then you're going to want to click it. I click it. It sorts through all the stories and it pulls up the ones that are memory. Blood sugar pulls up the ones that are blood sugar. Discomfort in the body. Look at all these. Look at all these. Right. If it's um. Somebody who's bitten by a tick, click, click, tick bite, right? Um, so let's just say I go to spectrum behavior, okay? I click this one. I read the description. I'm like, I, I want to read this one. Why? Because it says transformation of 11-year-old boy on the spectrum, massive improvement in speaking and communicating, managing his emotions, and better motor function. Okay, well, I want to watch this one. All right, because if I have a child on the spectrum, then I, this is the one I want to see it. I want to watch all yeah, those. But when you look at this, he, these parents are being interviewed about what happened. Now, you can change the subtitles to English. You can change the subtitles to uh, French, to German, to Italian, to Korean, you, to Arabic, 28 languages. And you know what? All I cared about when I was, this was brought to me with my dad was his issue. I didn't care about, I was 50 at the time. I didn't care about me. My dad was just told he had something horrible. And all I cared about was that. And I had to get on the phone and find people to talk to, to that had that issue. This is this site is a gift that we have this. It is absolutely amazing. Yes, it is. Um, another question I have. So maybe, you know, people that <laughs> have an issue, they're taking certain medications right now, or they've got handfuls of supplements that they're taking. I hear commonly, look, do I keep taking this? Can I get rid of these things? Can I just replace it with the redox? 
talk to talk to me about what that looks like for people. Just keep taking everything. The only very you're, when you fill out that benchmark form, keep taking your supplements, keep doing your yoga, keep taking your medicine, do everything, and say all these things got me to where I am today. Let's see what happens with this. Now, um, and then if you're taking medicines as needed, say you get bad headaches and you take the medicine when you get a headache, if you don't get the headaches anymore. Let's say you didn't get this, say you didn't, then don't take the medicine anymore. But if you take a medicine to prevent headaches and your doctor has you taking it every single day, don't stop taking the medicine, right? Just, just baseline how, even with that, how often do you get the headaches? If you're taking something for cholesterol or depression or blood pressure, we're not saying this is going to help those things. You're going to determine if it helps you or not. But if you're if if you find, hey, my mood is much better, and you talk to your, do I still need to take this pill for my mood? Then talk to your doctor about getting off the medicines. Okay, that's very very important. Yeah, absolutely. Now, what about uh, kids? So, so talk to me about is it safe number one for kids, and also how much they need because you mentioned that as you're younger you're making a lot, yeah. and as you're older you're not. So uh, it makes sense, you know, if you're older. But what about if you're younger? All depends on on how how healthy their mitochondria are. Kids generally need less, a little less. And I'll give it to my dog. My dog is 24 pounds, takes less, but there's no overdosing one. There's no overdosing. Um, it, it, as soon as a, as soon as a, a human being or an animal has a mitochondria, they're making this already. So it's in the fetus. The fetus has it already. One thing with medications, when I go back, if someone is diabetic and they're controlled just by diet, then they don't have to do what I'm about to say. But if they take anything by mouth or injection that lowers their blood sugar, it's very important that they monitor their, their levels of, of their blood, their blood sugar levels every day. <clears throat> let's just say, let's not talk about a C because I don't want any medical claims. Let's just say that, that they started taking some supplement, okay, something, and it made their pancreas start making more insulin and they weren't aware of it. And they blindly took their medicine to, to push down their blood glucose. It, it, the medicine could push their blood glucose levels too low and that's called hypoglycemia. That's very dangerous. So it's very important to anybody that's taking a medicine for blood sugar, when they take this, we would just say it's very important for them to monitor their blood glucose to know what's going on. Absolutely. Um, and kids, you know, how much are they taking? Oh, just like I say, instead of four ounces a day, if they're little kids, they take, take two ounces a day. I mean, it really doesn't matter if they took four ounces a day or not, because the body turns the excess back into saline. Yeah. Now what happens if you stop? So I know a lot of people get concerned because they always hear, oh, if I'm on the steroid and I stop taking it, it's a problem. I need to taper off. Do you have to taper off of this? Does your body stop making redox when you're drinking it? Like, talk to me about that. Great question. I had that question too. So <clears throat> Like steroids, when people take a steroid like prednisone, they take a certain amount and they can't just stop it because their adrenals that's making the similar molecule, the body says, oh, I got I don't have to make it anymore. So if you stop, you can die, right, with, with steroids. This is not that case. This is being made during the process where your body makes ATP, which is the molecule you burn for fuel. So my body used to make this much of redox molecules and this much ATP, but it's producing less of both. I drink this, it raises my levels of, of redox molecules, but it doesn't raise my levels of ATP. So my body has to keep making it. So if I stop taking this today in two weeks, I just go back to where I was, which I don't want to, I don't want to feel like I'm 63. I like feeling like I'm 30. Yeah, fair. <laughs> um, now, how long is it going to take to see results? So people that have a specific health issue, they're always like, well, how much do I need to take and how long, you know, until until this um, this works on it? Can you speak to that? Well, it's not really working on it. The body's working on it, right? But I went through those expectations. Like, so I'm not saying that every problem in 90 days were, were hey, we're all 18 years old again. I'm just saying by 90 days, 90% 90 of people know that this is real. <laughs> And over time, as longer they take it, the, hopefully the more shifts they see happen. And if you if you saw great shifts at four ounces and you just stayed there, you want to have an experiment, go 90 days where you're drinking eight ounces a day and watch what happens. I drink eight ounces a day every day, every single day. And, you know, if I'm sick, if I, if I let's say there's some horrible thing spreading around the world and, and I got hit with it, I was taking a bottle a day. It didn't make any difference to me. It, I, I, I'm not saying it cures me or heals me or prevents anything. I'm just saying I want my body, I want my signaling on all the way. But it's just if I was to call 911 with my cell phone, I, I want to have good signal, right? It, it doesn't work if it doesn't have good signal and our body doesn't work well if we don't have good signal. 
Yeah, absolutely. It just, just helps your body know where the issues are. So the longer yeah. you stay on it, the kind of, I always think about it like the body has its own checklist, right? That inner doctor is like this first, this second, and we might not be consciously aware of some of the things that it's working on. Um, the gel is nice because you can tell it where to go, but the liquid sometimes just be patient and using that that health tracker to baseline is so helpful. Um, talk about the taste. So this is something I think it ends up shocking some people <laughs> and confusing them because it seems to like change. Um, yeah. You know, this doesn't taste like strawberries. So what? talk to us about the taste. You know, it never tasted funny to me. Um, and it's interesting. Um, it tastes differently to different people. In fact, if you're sitting at someone's house right now and, and your host gives everybody a taste, ask, watch the faces and ask everybody what it tastes like. You know, Bob will say it tastes like water. Sue will say it tastes like salt water. Uh, Jerry will say it tastes like swimming pool water. It tastes different to everybody. Um, the more toxic you are, the more toxins you have in your bodies, we all have toxins, the more it tastes chlorine-y. Tasting, this, it's not chlorine, it's hypochlorite that's in there. But, um, but it's funny, the, the person that tastes like water, they're like, well, what do you mean it tastes like swimming pool water? Or the person with swimming pool water says, what do you mean it tastes like water? Everybody's different. The longer you're on it, the more it just starts tasting like water because your body, your, your detox. And the toxins affect your taste buds as well. So it's just, it's just a thing that happens, but it will taste like water over time. Yeah. And you can refrigerate it, you know, if the taste is a little funny, I, yeah. that can cut it. You can hold your nose because you're really smelling it. So yeah. there's things you can do, but it's not that bad. <laughs> Um, for, for the and, breakthrough for humanity, it's not a big deal. Honest to God. I mean, it's just, it's just not a big deal at all for what it does. Um, th this is a gift. Uh, this is much more than anybody can fathom. And everybody in the history of mankind has always wanted to live younger, longer, <clears throat> no matter how much money somebody has, they get to a point in life that's going to wish I was younger. I wish I could come back. Well, I'm 63 and I feel like I'm 30. I, I would never, ever ever, ever give this up. And thank God, Virtus Norton and Tyler Norton, who founded the company, said no to the pharmaceutical buyout because they would have just buried it. They would have buried it if they got their hands on it. Yeah, absolutely. Um, the last thing, you know, I was just looking around. I have these things all over my desk. Um, di different ways to use Redox. So uh, I have this spray bottle, ASEA sells them. I also, you turned me on to this thing. It's a nano mister, which is fantastic. Uh, can you talk about why someone might want these? Well, again, this is a supplement, right? And so in that bottle, you you poured this into that bottle in that little nano mister <clears throat> nebulizer. So, you know, we're not saying this, you know, is going to help eye conditions. We don't, we don't. But we can say three words about this that you can't say about eye drops or any medicine. It can't hurt. So if you have, if you're using medicines or things for whatever your health issue is, and you want to try something that's natural, and just see what happens for you. The th thing is, there's no risk. So you can spray it in your eye. If you've got um, uh, breathing challenges, lungs is made up of cells. You know, so if cells are healthy, we're healthy. That's the whole idea behind this. And you want to put it in a nebulizer and inhale it. You can do it and just watch what happens. There's just no risk to it, which is a beautiful thing. Yeah, absolutely. Well, those are the most common questions that I get. I don't know if there's anything that you want to say to kind of wrap this up and uh, help people, you know, on their journey with learning about this. I would just say, look, you and everybody you know, I'm talking to you if you're new, is going to be on this product one day. <clears throat> Hopefully, you're going to make a decision to do it today to get on this product. What's the risk? Uh, oh, there is no risk. You can't be allergic to it. There's no toxicity. It doesn't interfere with medicines, and there's a money-back guarantee. So there is no risk on it. Um, and come to know that it's real. And hopefully you'll 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 share this with people. You either refer people to your friend because you're grateful to them for introducing you this, this to you, or you'll say, "Hey, I want to get involved with this. This is fun. I get to help people. This is a thrill. I, I'm, I just put this on ten people, and nine of them say, "Where do I get this? This is amazing," and be part of this. And look, there's an opportunity here, right? An opportunity to get your product for free by basically sharing this. The company spends no money on advertising. So all the money that will go to advertising and spokespeople and representatives that are out there going into doctor's offices, it goes to us. And so when you're on subscription and you're on the essentials bundle, every every month you're getting six bottles of this, or you're getting free tube of gel and free shipping, and you get rebates. You can get rebates on that too called reward points. Um, you're getting it every month. That's a residual cost to you, right? It's an investment to you for your health, but you can get it for free. By sharing this with people, the company is going to pay pay you. Every time they get product, they're going to pay you. The money that will go to advertisers. So um, 
I, I we're going to make a shift here. And Danielle is like me, started on the product, you know, had no interest in the business, saw what the product did, realized that no one else knew about it that they knew, saw they could help a lot of people and make money to get their product for free and take it far beyond that if you want to. Like I make a lot more money than I did as a doctor owning my own practice and surgery center, but I make money while I sleep. So that's not just making a lot more money. It gives me time freedom, right? I am completely free. Every day of my life, I am free to do whatever I want to do. At 63, I would still be in my office, right? Going to my office since I was 28 years old. Well, I don't do that anymore. I can help people much more dramatically. I can teach anybody to help people with this product. I don't have to be a doctor. Danielle's not a doctor. She's a diamond executive in this company because she told people who told people who told people and mentored people and it spread around the world for her. And all those people that are consuming these products and the other products the company makes, she's getting paid on that every time. So listen, listen carefully to the way Danielle explains this. She does it so eloquently and in a non-businessy way. This is a purpose-driven business and, and she is just an amazing person and a perfect example of the caliber of person and people who get involved with this. So Danielle, I'm gonna turn it over to you to talk about the opportunity side, okay? Awesome, thanks. Well, I love what you already shared so far with it. And, you know, I uh, I remember and probably a question that maybe is bouncing in your mind that we didn't answer is like, well, if this stuff is so good, how come I haven't heard about it yet? You know, if it's been around for 15 years up to this point, you know, why don't I know about it? Well, <laughs> uh, I want to share with you something called the law of diffusion of innovation. Okay. And this will answer that question for you. This is the adoption cycle that every disruptive technology goes through for the, the mass market to actually start to use it, to integrate it, to have it in their daily life. And it's a bell curve. We've all seen bell curves. So with this bell curve, you have the early adopters, people that just jump in, they get it, they're excited about it. You know, right now, all of us are going through <laughs> a very disruptive technology coming into the marketplace, which is AI. And we've had some early adopters jump in, right? You might know some people, you might be one of them. That's like, this is amazing. It's saving me time. I love it. But there's a chasm that is needing to be bridged before the masses start using this technology, right? And starts to get into the majority. That's the, the kind of middle of the bell curve. And then you have the laggards. Right. I'm sure, you know, another disruptive technology I think we're all aware of is Uber right? that came in and just blew up the taxi business. And and uh, there were some early adopters that jumped in, took some time before, you know, the general population was comfortable getting into a stranger's car. And there's still some laggards. Right. Still some people that have never actually done it or don't have the app on their phone. But this is the same that's been true with ASEA. And I kind of want to draw your attention to this part right here, the chasm. All right, they've had to bridge this gap. And over the last 15 years, that's exactly what they've been doing. And they've been doing it in two ways. One, through people, through stories, through experiences. You know, there are people that you saw on that website, Dr. Silverman shared, and I would encourage you every single day, just listen to one of those stories. You know, it'll give you goosebumps to see the breadth and depth of things that Redox can help the body to just, you know, understand, hey, there's an issue. Let's, let's go deal with it. But this chasm has been bridged by those stories, tens of thousands and also research. So I have here just kind of a snapshot of the research that's currently going on with ASEA, partnerships they have all over the world uh, with, you know, in Australia, in Spain, in Germany, uh, in the United States, laboratories that are looking, they're doing structure function studies. They're trying to figure out more about the impact that these molecules have in our body. And look, redox signaling is a huge field of science. It's massive. This is ASEA specific. So ASEA is the only ones that have been able to stabilize these molecules outside the body in a bioactive form. And that's what's most important. That, I mean, that is the breakthrough, what they've been able to do with that. And so there's research all over that's helping to close this chasm where people are now going, oh, there's double blind placebo controlled studies. Okay, I'm listening, you know, tell me more. And I want to talk about this bell curve a little bit more. So that initial phase, right, the uh, early adopters, I call them the pioneers in ASEA because they have been ridiculed. They have faced opposition. Dr. Silverman mentioned, you know, on Google, um, you might see some information that opposes this. that says, no, it's just salt water. And I always laugh because I think about like rewind 100 years ago, you know, early 1900s. Uh, can you imagine if a friend said, hey, come over to the house or something I want to share with you. And what they share with you is bread mold. And they start talking about how bread mold is going to change, you know, the way medicine operates and it's going to save so many lives and, and all of this. And you're like, my friend is nuts. 
right? <laughs> you're probably like laughing at them and for sure, you know, ridiculing and, and opposing what they're saying. Well, it turns out, what is penicillin? Where did that come from? How did it revolutionize, you know, our ability to, to fight back, to give the body what it needs? Like it changed the medical field as we know it. Well, guys, the same thing is happening with redox. This is right now a little known biotech company and product, but it will be a household name. And we're moving into that phase now, right? We're bridging that chasm. We're getting into that mass market. And so this is going to go from a little known health science breakthrough to a household name. The blue bottle will be in everyone's home. Why wouldn't it be? It's safe. It's going to help each body uniquely know where, you know, it's having stuff going on. It just makes sense. And guys, this is where opportunity lies for you. Because it is a very simple system that we use to share this. Number one, you just connect with people. I know that you know people. You've probably thought of them already that you think, I wonder if this could help them. Write their names down. There's a reason they came to you. Step two, ask them. Simple question. Have you heard of Redox? Would you be open to learning about something that can support your health in a new way? There's been a breakthrough. Have you heard about it? Right, simple. And then introduce them to information, to an expert that can explain this, right? You don't have to come read some redox expert. You don't have to become that. You can invite them over, rub gel on them, play a video, you know, let them come to a webinar. There are plenty of people that can explain this for you. All right, this is Ricardo. Okay, he was working for the government 15 years, but hated his job. He had absolutely no passion for it, okay? And ASEA came into his world because of his health. He was interested in it. For health reasons. And then he just started telling people he was so excited about it. And his girlfriend, Ruthie at the time said, Hey, listen, you know, why don't you actually partner with the company? Now you're talking about this anyway, you can get paid for sharing. And so with no business experience, Ricardo found a mentor in the company and he began learning the simple system that I just showed you. So now alongside of his full-time job, he's been able to help others create another income stream and have passion and purpose in his life. All right. Mentorship is key. You don't need to know everything, right? You have a mentor sitting, waiting to support you. And think about any good athlete, uh, anyone that's been successful in business and really anything, they usually have had a mentor or a coach to help them along the way. And this is a very elegant business model. Someone can only succeed if they help other people succeed. It's like a team sport. It's very different than corporate America where you're trying to climb the ladder and you're kind of in competition with people and, you know, it's it's stressful. It's intense. No, this is everybody. We're only going to win if we work together. And so it's very supportive. We have this concept called believe, belong, become. We tell people, look, if you can believe in yourself and believe it or not, that's kind of the hardest one for many people to believe that this is possible. They could do it right between the ears. You, you get in your way. If they can believe in the technology, which you already are, right? You've experienced that this works. It's real. <laughs> and that's just the tip of the iceberg. Uh, believe in the company, which I'm going to tell you a little bit more about them. Uh, believe in the model of network marketing, you know, believe in the community that supports the systems in place to help you with this. You'll start to belong to this community and you will become a better version of you. Your seed will be planted in the right soil so you can become the best version of you. And I've watched it happen again and again. It's happened for me. And so I want to take a moment now and make this kind of come into your world about why ASEA might be entering. And I put this up here because, well, number one, I loved the movie Aladdin when I was young. But I want you to imagine that you've just found this genie lamp. And we all know when you rub a genie lamp, right, the genie pops out and usually says you have three wishes. Well, today you've got one. All right. If I am your genie and I'm saying, OK, what is the one thing? If you could snap your fingers and this was automatically changed in your life, what would it be? And play along. Don't just listen to me and laugh and whatever. Or roll your eyes. Like, what is on your heart? What is the thing that you're wanting? What needs to change? Is it your health? Is that what you're wanting? I know what that's like because I lost mine. Is it freedom? You want flexibility, the ability to go where you want when you want to go there. Uh, maybe you want to get rid of debt. There's credit card debt that's piling up and you're not sure what to do. Uh, perhaps you just want a better life to go to the grocery store and not have to worry about how much is in the bank. You know, to be able to pick the organic food and not have to get you know the other food and not have to worry about the price. Perhaps you have a dream of a beautiful home that you want to build or purchase. Uh, maybe you want to go on a, a unique and very special once-in-a-lifetime family vacation. Perhaps you're sick of your commute and you just want to be able to work from your computer anywhere. Maybe, like Ricardo, you need purpose in your life. You want to love what you do and do what you love. Perhaps you have everything and you're like, Danielle, if I could snap my fingers, I want to deal with poverty. 
in the world. I want to help other people that are less fortunate than me. Uh, maybe you want a group of friends, a group of like minds, a group of people to hang out with and just make an impact with, you know, as you, as you grow older. Whatever it is for you, there's a reason Asiya has come into your world. And I want to share with you what happened with me, my journey. You know, Dr. Silverman mentioned a little bit uh, about my story. This is the morning of the car accident. I was hit by a drunk driver and my life changed that day. Uh, I lost my health. I also lost my ability to work. And a couple of lessons I learned. Number one <laughs> was the power of redox. Okay. That came into my world about two years after my accident. And I'm very grateful um, for how it helped my body to know where the damage was. And my body could finally, you know, kind of get, get back to functioning optimally. But as I started to get my health back and I started to think about, well, what do I want to do with my life? How do I want to spend my time? I couldn't unknow that tomorrow's not guaranteed. That morning, I was 7 a.m. I was going to a wedding. Like I was doing nothing wrong. And someone fell asleep driving and hit me head on. Like could have ended my life. We're here by a thread, all of us. And we never know when that time is going to be. And so why not make the most of today? So I knew as I was getting my health back, I want to do something that's going to give me purpose. That's going to help me just have passion, you know, in my day, to be excited, to have joy. And I also knew I wanted to do something that was going to make income come in, even if I lost my health again, okay? Because the scariest thing was having this accident happen and being physically unable to work. Because up to that point in my life, I was 23, every job I'd had since the age of 16, I got paid an hourly wage or a salary. So I put in my time, I got money. All of a sudden I couldn't even put in my time, I got no money. And so for several years, I had no income and it was terrifying. And so I thought, you know what? I don't ever want to be in a situation where I could lose my health and lose my income again. So what could I do that could create that kind of, you know, residual passive income stream? And my mom was the one that said, well, ASEA did now, network marketing. And I said, oh, that's sleazy. You know, I'm not interested in that kind of thing. And she said, I don't, I don't think you really understand it. And she kind of pushed me on it. And, you know, well, where was this coming from that I had these, you know, aversions to network marketing? And it was, I kind of came down to, well, just like society had told me that, you know, kind of just culture had said it's not a good thing. I, I really had nothing to base it off of, you no know, direct experience myself. And she said, come learn about this company, who you'd be partnering with and what it actually looks like. And this is what I found out. And I want to teach you the same. You would be partnering with a company that was founded back in 2009. Okay, they are privately owned. They don't have to answer to the, you know, the bottom line of investors. Uh, they have been profitable since their first year. They carry no long-term debt, which has allowed them to be very agile, you know, in situations like with the pandemic and shipping issues, et cetera. Everything's made here in the United States, FDA registered facility. You can go tour it if you want, if you're ever out in Utah. Uh, and they have 20 different global distribution centers. So it gets to over 30 markets around the world, 30 different governments, 30, almost 35 now, I think, have said yes. Uh, to allowing for this product to be in their country. And they've opened it up. The company's done over a billion in revenue. They have dozens of patents and IP, intellectual property, which is key. It's like trade secret. So nobody can figure out how to stab stabilize these molecules in the same way that we have. It's protected. So what does that mean? If you're thinking about this, right? They put on the hat of an entrepreneur, looking at an opportunity. This is something that supports everybody. It makes a big impact. They're going to want it continually. <laughs> nobody else can make it. And this company is not a startup. They've been around for, you know, since 2009. Um, they, they've been profitable since their first year. They know what they're doing. But kind of the cherry on top of all of this, they're a P over E company. What does that mean? <laughs> well, I didn't understand it when I first heard it, but let me share with you. The P stands for principles, people, purpose, above ego and economics. The inception with which this started Right, Virtus Norton said no to a buyout from a pharmaceutical company because he thought it was not going to be able to get into the hands of the people that needed it and the people that were currently taking it, their beta group, were going to have to come off of it. And he said, I can't morally do that. I can't look them in their eyes and tell them that. So he said no to multi-millions, generational wealth, right? 69 years old, he, had, he didn't need to say no to that. He could have taken it and, you know, sailed away into retirement. He said, no, this is something that humanity needs. This will be my legacy on this planet. And so he chose people. He chose, and, and this is what started with the P over E. There's an ethos here, a corporate soul, all right? And you will feel it. The people that are drawn in to work with this company, you feel it, and it's principle-driven, all right? Their uh, Advancing Life Foundation, I think, is an example of this. It's a nonprofit that they started, and ASEA covers all of the operating costs, all right? And anything that is donated to Advancing Life, they match it. 
So I get my essentials bundle, you know, on subscription and I donate to Advancing Life and ASEA matches that donation. And they do projects all over the world, not just in the countries that we're open in, many of the countries that we don't even do business in. Why? Because we want to give back because their mission statement is to better people's lives and be a force for good in the world. But you get to wake up and be a part of. I mean, it's incredible. Uh, this is a website that I, I would encourage you to go to, realredoxresults.biz, B-I-Z, password redox. People from all over the world, all walks of life, all ages, sharing why they partner with the SIA, why they decided to become a pioneer, why they wanted to bring this out there, you know, and not just take the product and enjoy the benefits themselves, but why they started to feel like responsible and they wanted to share it with others and they wanted to create, you know, an impact in the world. This will inspire you. You know, um, the network of people you will meet here is incredible. It's like the added bonus. You know, this is a friend of mine, Edwina. She lives on the other side of the world and never would have met her were it not for Asiya. But she is a mom of four. Uh, at the time that Asiya came into her world, her daughter was not well. And she needed to figure out how can I afford this product for her and the rest of my family. And so she used this simple system, those three steps that I taught you, to be able to figure out how to afford Asiya. <laughs> and and uh, after five months, not only was her daughter feeling better, they had enough income to cover the cost of the products and go on a 16-day vacation to Australia. She came back from that and she said, you know what? I want to help other mothers, other families to also have financial freedom, to have these options. And she's done that. And so for you, coming back to that wish, that thing that's on your heart, that is unique to you, I believe that ASEA could be the vehicle to get you there. And, you know, most of the wishes and desires that we have require money because that's just the world we're in right now. And there is an income level that very likely can bring that to you. And so what I want you to do is ask your mentor, how do I make an extra thousand dollars a month? They will guide you to becoming a director 700. They would say that is that is likely, you know, what you need to hit to be doing that. And they'll show you what you need to do. There's limitless possibilities. It just depends on the number of people that you connect with, right? And the distribution that you create with this and the impact, the ripple effect that gets created. Now understand, you don't have to see the whole staircase. You just need to take the first step. And I'm gonna show you the first step now. The first step is for you to go to discoverredoxtraining.com and watch the overview training there. If you wanna go a little bit deeper, go to the uh, ethos training with Tyler Norton. The trainings that he does are incredible. You'll get to you know, resonate with the heart and soul of this organization and who you're partnering with. Because it is a partnership, you know, <laughs> the heart and the lungs, we always say, we need both. They're critical. And then get into action. Start demoing the gel. Just like it was demoed on you, you go demo it on people. It will be absolutely um, something that will build your own belief and will create interest, people wanting to purchase it from you. And be consistent. Do those three steps. Plug people in. Get them informed. Get their questions answered. And ask your mentor, how do I get free product? There's something called the Fast Forward Program. Ask about it. Learn about it. It's the most foundational thing. It's going to get you free product to put back into your business. And also ask about the 20% off codes that you can get to start your business. So I'm so excited for you uh, to be on this journey and to be, you know, learning about this, being able to support other people uh, with this. It is a beautiful thing. You get paid in goosebumps and uh, very, very grateful, you know, that you're saying yes. And I can't wait to see if your wish gets fulfilled here.